Hey y'all, my name is Landon. My name is Kayla. And welcome to LK TV. Make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, and turn the post notifications on so that y'all can be part of the LK squad. Squad! Period! Y'all, so today we got some zucchini, uh, spaghetti, and salad. And then, yeah. Then we're just gonna, <laughs> for all our, like, we got like about 150 new subscribers. So we wanted to do is reintroduce ourselves for y'all. Maybe you can start. Okay, well I'm Kayla. Um, I know you, I know you're gonna put me on the spot first, whatever though. Uh, but yeah, I'm Kayla. Um, Jill Kayla, but I go by Kayla. Uh, I'm Landon's wife. <laughs> y'all, I'm so boring. I don't know. I don't know how to introduce myself. Um, what, what should I tell them? Everything. Everything. Okay, y'all. Uh, well, I'm 23. Um, born and raised in Oklahoma. Uh, I don't know, y'all. Ain't got no interesting facts about me, really. Y'all, she a nurse. She Indian. <laughs> None of that was interesting. That is interesting. That I'm Indian. And yeah, and that you're a nurse. That is interesting. Okay. Um. Uh, what else? She's an only child. So am I. She's a Taurus. Like you got a lot of stuff. Uh, I'm left handed. Um, y'all, I'm short. I'm five two. I'm gonna like. Let's see. Mm. What's a fun fact? A fun fact about me. Mm -hmm. Um. I don't know. Even though I'm left handed, I'm stronger in my right hand. Mm -hmm. I, only, I only write with my left hand. That's the only thing I do with my, do with my left hand. But with my right hand, I'm stronger and everything. Yeah. Um, let me think. Um, well, my name is Landon. Like y'all already know. <laughs> um, I'm not from Oklahoma. I claim Texas. Um, I am an only child also. Left-handed. Um, I think we're going to do our introduction and then, like, do, like, how we manage stuff. Kind of, like, something like that for y'all. Um, let me think. Uh, I work in the travel industry. I'm little, too. I'm only five feet. <laughs> uh, I am part of the LGBT, LGBT community. I'm part of the T community. <laughs> um, <laughs> Let me see. I've been um on testosterone since twenty nineteen. Uh I'm a bariatric patient. I had surgery last December twenty twenty two. Um it will be a year on the twenty seventh of December. Uh let me see. I've lost what like hundred and twenty pounds. Um I'm a Virgo. Uh let me see. Fun fact, well, a couple of fun facts. My mom's the only child also. My grandma is the youngest of all her siblings. Um, let me see. I write poetry. Um, I like to play video games. <laughs> what? You got a lot more facts than me. <laughs> y'all, she got other stuff. She just, like, be acting shy. Um, fun fact about her, she sucks her finger. Um, what? That's a fun fact. Is it a fun? Is it a fun fact? Yeah, people wouldn't know that. Y'all, I suck. Since you gonna bring it up, I since I suck this finger, and I don't know if y'all can tell, but my finger is crooked. Yeah, let me see. Let me try to like zoom in on it. See, see <laughs> um, it also has the um the indents for where my teeth are sitting against it. Mm -hmm. I, <laughs> I can't believe you didn't tell these people I suck my finger. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah so um y'all uh let me think how we met um i think on tammy yeah we met on this dating app called tammy uh i think it was probably like um last december like about two weeks before i had my surgery um, we wasn't really trying to, like, be in a relationship type thing. 
<laughs> now look at us. Married. Y'all got married in February, too. We got married quick. Mm -hmm. Oh, well, that's my version. Yeah, we got married in February. <laughs> I asked her to marry me in January. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this was December 2022. Yeah, I married in February 2023. Um, It was just my, my mom and her dad there. Very small wedding. Um, and she was just like, yeah, we wouldn't even like, oh no, like, what's that word? It wouldn't even, oh no, like, um, very, ro I ain't gonna lie, like, it wasn't really no very romantic thing. We was in the bed, and then, then Bay was like, oh, we should get married. I was like, will you marry me? She's like, yeah. <laughs> and we just like went from there. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Babe, I keep looking at your hand. Like it's something on your hand. What's on my hand? Like on the front part. What's on my hand? You don't see it. See what? It's right here. Right there. Oh. What is that? I don't know. I was in there cooking, so I don't know. Smell it. You're weird. <laughs> it's chocolate. What? You where we get chocolate from? I don't know, but it's chocolate. Smell it. It's chocolate. Mm. That's chocolate. Oh. But. <laughs> yeah, y'all. So. Mm. That's like a little rundown on like how we made and stuff. Y'all, we got so many facts about us. We just. I don't know. We just can't think right now. It feels good though. You like it? Mm hmm. Yeah, we did zucchini spaghetti. I do got ground beef in it. And it has um, uh, zucchini, of course, and cheese, and tomato sauce, and tomato paste, right? And garlic. And garlic. And then we got a side salad. Yeah, I'm feeling a lot better today. Thank y'all if y'all was, you know, sending good vibes and praying for me. Feeling a lot better today. Um, let me try to think. Because we have, we're, like, we're, I, that's why we tell y'all to <laughs> ask questions in the comments. Because we don't really be knowing. Like, um, another fun fact is I wrote a poem that ended up being in a book. Um, ended up winning the scholarship money off of it. Uh, that was like my sophomore year in high school. Um, what do you think? Babe, you have a lot of a a accolades also. Mm -hmm. Oh, I'm part of uh, a fraternity also. I don't know. Like, I don't really had much going on. I just been working. Well, okay, so I did get a full ride scholarship to finish my BSN. So one of the top schools in Tulsa. But gotta wait to go there. Um about oops, Lord. But yeah, I got my LPM. I just um gonna finish up and get my BS in because I want my bachelor's. And y'all want my bachelor's before 25, but that's not gonna happen because I'm already 23. And it's like a year and a half program. But it's fine. Before I'm 26, though, I had a bachelor's. That's fine. I, don't, I don't do get it. Yeah. You can be 30. It don't matter. You got it. Oh, it don't matter. I do not want to be... I don't want to be going to school past 20... Past 27. I don't know. I just feel like old. <laughs> not old, but you know like how... I guess like how old people feel like when they like be in a classroom full of like younger people. Like oh, you got people from like... Like youngins. Mm -hmm. Like 18... 18. But not all of them be young though. Not all of them, but majority. I don't think that bothers me because I'm I got one come and go. You know? Mm-hmm. I have um, to get my degree. I don't mind younger people though. I just feel like I'm just gonna be like one of the not even one of the oldest ones because when I went to get my LPN, the oldest the oldest um what's that called? My oldest classmate. I'm sorry, y'all. Mm. My oldest classmate was like 52. Mm. 
And I was like, okay, period. Why you tell people it ain't about when you start is how you finish. So mm -hmm. if y'all adults and y'all want to go back to school, y'all worrying about what other people don't think, go do it. Get that degree. See, I'm not a school person. I tried it like four times. Didn't like it. <laughs> um, but I do want to probably be in corrections. I've been thinking about that, but I don't know. Them people killing people in there. Um, and I'm a little scary, so. <laughs> it's mm -hmm. So I've been thinking on it. I think you should. Also, if y'all have anybody that's even in the correctional world, put some comments down below on how they like it. Because mm -hmm. I love to hear other people like, um, what other people go through. I have a, a fraternity brother that is, and but he just started and he's like he liked it. But I'm like, mm, I need people that's been in there for a minute. Like what? Like what has he seen? Like really going? I need some. Yeah. I need some good details. I need somebody <laughs> to go. I need him to go through. Um, what's it called? Um, lockdown and stuff. <laughs> yeah, like um, all that. Yeah, when the inmates start riots and stuff. Mm. I need him to go through all that. That sounds so scary. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie to you, a bunch of angry inmates mm -hmm. against a couple of guards. Yeah. Ooh, no. There's always more inmates than guards. Mm hmm. Of course. Unless they're like calling, like, what? Who they calling? SWAT team or somebody? Mm -hmm. I don't know who they gonna call. That's still not enough. You have about 1,100 inmates. There's like 50. Yeah, that's true. And the inmates know in and out. Guards don't. Yeah, but. You know, they got they got guns and stuff though. Inmates can make a make something that's gunnable. Gunnable. <laughs> <laughs> it's shootable. Yeah, it's shootable. Not gunnable. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I meant. <laughs> Y'all, we over here turn this food up. Yeah. Oh hold on. Your food gone. <laughs> no, I eat it. Yeah, I haven't been eating either. I haven't really had an appetite. They've been forcing me to eat. But I mean, I ate a little bit earlier. I had, um, what was it? Zucchini Alfredo. Really, really good, y'all. If y'all want to eat something, but y'all like, oh, I'm tired of eating pasta, we recommend zucchini. Um, if y'all want to spend a little bit more money, Fiber Gourmet. If y'all want me to type that in the comments for people that really are interested, just respond. What's the names of the, uh, of the, pasta alternatives we got y'all as we only like zucchini we like squash but we haven't had it as a spaghetti yet we've only had it as a yam um as a, a sweet potato alternative mm -hmm. we tried it like one time but i didn't think i don't think i cooked it long enough so it wasn't shredding right mm -hmm. so i was like well never mind my bad <laughs> <laughs> so we've only tried these two options we love the zucchini like baby really really like because i'm be honest with y'all zucchini doesn't taste like anything so all you all it's like it's just a pasta you know if you really think about it pasta don't taste like that so what you think i feel like i'm full though i'm really full but do you think like zucchini tastes like anything it tastes like vegetables <laughs> yeah. yeah oh yeah. also if y'all like want a pasta i'll turn it up i'm sorry uh not really, not really a pasta alternative, but like, let's say y'all go to Olive Garden and be like, I don't want the Alfredo with noodles. Tell them to sub it for broccoli. That's what I do when I go to Olive Garden. Or Applebee's, they have that Alfredo. Um, it's really good, too. Because broccoli also is a neutral taste. That's what we do for Alfredo also if we don't want it. If we don't feel like doing the zucchini. What were you about to say? Oh, I just forgot now. You know... You know my mind be one track. Y'all, I hope that y'all liked our introduction. We did ramble on a little bit. We just kept going. Yeah, because I, I mean, we not, I don't want to say we're boring, because I don't think we are. We just, you know, adults. And we unfortunately don't really have a lot of friends. So that's why our subscribers, our YouTubers, like all of y'all, we appreciate y'all for just watching us and just, stand the course with us and all of that 
And we do like plan on like later on in the future probably having like a friends like what trip or something like that. Mm -hmm. Like with our subscribers so that we can just a squad trip. Yeah, like a squad trip, you know. Um, so that y'all could come along with us. Mm -hmm. You got anything else to say? Y'all, when we get like up there, we're gonna do uh, what is that? A meet and greet or whatever. Mm -hmm. We're gonna be signing stuff. I mean, I'm nervous. I'm not nervous. I'm excited because I like meeting people in person. I don't think I don't want to say I'm not a people's person, but I'm also not a people's person. It it depends on the atmosphere. I have to read the situation first. But we definitely will do a meet and greet. Cause I know Babe definitely wants to do it. I'll be down. Yay! So, y'all go ahead and get us up there so we can do this little meet and greet, you know. Um, it'll probably be out here in the Oklahoma. Oklahoma. If not, if not, it'll probably be in Atlanta. Who going to Atlanta? Atlanta's a good, like, meet-up spot, too. I don't like Atlanta. Texas. You just name spots. That so, you where would you, like. that's what I'm saying, like, where would we meet up at? Because those are meet-up spots. I don't know. Maybe, I guess, maybe Atlanta. We're not going to Texas, though. Y'all, I can't stand Texas. It makes my booty hole pucker every time we get to Texas. All right, y'all. If y'all like this video, <laughs> make sure y'all comment down below and share it. We love y'all so much, and we out. Peace. Peace.